Hey Brandy, my name is Erin. I'm with Duff Digital Marketing, a marketing agency here in Greensboro. And I happen to be doing some research in your area and came across your website. So I figured I would shoot you all a quick video to give you three tips on how you can beat out your competition online. I do not want to waste your time and I don't want to waste mine either, so I'll keep this nice and short. But if by the end of this video, uh, you can tell that I have a lot of tricks up my sleeve that can help grow your business online and that's something that you're interested in, please reach out to me and we can chat. If not, no worries. Please take the tips I've given you here today for free and put them into action. The only thing that I do ask is that you'll please give, please give me some feedback on this video if you don't mind. So without further ado, I'll go ahead and get into it. The three things that I want to cover today are going to be content, citations, and backlinks. So first up is content, and that's basically anything that you can see on the first page of your website here. That also does include the pictures and what they're saved as, and also what's behind the pictures can also be considered content. Uh, so these are things that the search engine can read and get an idea of what the services that you offer are, uh, the area that you're targeting, and uh, the position you are ranking in the search. So having unique, authoritative excuse me, content and enough of it to add in the keywords or key phrases that people are going to be searching Google for to locate your services. Um, looking at your website, it doesn't look like there's quite enough content here, um, but the layout of your website is very nice, very appealing to the eye. Um, I do like the animations that you guys have on here as well, and it's very organized, so it looks really nice. Um, so that's really all that I have as far as that goes. Uh, the second tip that I have for you is citations. So looking at a Google search for beauty bars in Greensboro, North Carolina, um, you will see this section right here, which this is called the map pack. And this is where you want to be. Um, and essentially, as far as citations, what they are is just anywhere that your business name, address, and phone number are listed in various directories all throughout the web. So you may be asking yourself, what is a directory and how can I get myself into one of those? To put it simply, it's basically Yellow Pages, Facebook, LinkedIn, and any other places online that allow business owners to add their business details and services within there. That would be considered a directory. So in order to rank high on the maps here, you would need to make sure that you're looking at your competition's directory listings and seeing what they're currently being listed in. Then you would want to go out and get yourself listed in there as well. But you don't just want to stop um, at whatever your competition is doing, you want to do more. That way you're completely dominating them in that space and that will help you rank um, here in the search as well. So now that we have covered the content and the citations, the last thing I want to cover is backlinks. That has a lot to do with the organic section of Google, which is anything below the map pack down here. Um, the way that backlinks work is there is a website out there that has a link to your website and is essentially pushing power to your site, which is potentially bringing traffic to you. Backlinks are not all created equal, however. So for example, say there's an ice cream shop that you did some work with the owner and they are giving you a link, but it's all about ice cream. It's not gonna do much good for you since it has nothing to do with your business. You want links from another beauty bar or a salon um, that's actually sending a link back to your website that says, yes, they are a beauty bar or in the beauty industry. That way it lets Google know and it'll be a lot more powerful because it's unique and it's also relevant to your industry as well. Um, so looking at one of the tools that I have here, this is called Arifs and it's not 100% accurate, but it is a company that buys data from Google. So it gives me an idea of what's working well for you and what's working well for your competition also. Um, so with this, I can see that you all currently have one referring domain, which is giving you one backlink. Um, and out of those backlinks, there aren't any organic keywords that are ranking. And like I said, this is just a tool. It's not 100% accurate. If you want the most accurate information, you would need to get that straight from Google Analytics. Um, but if there were uh, keywords, you would be able to see them here. Um, and it looks like actually there is a pedicure Greensboro that looks like it's just not bringing any traffic and the position is position 89 on Google. It does look like it is a lost um, 
keyword so it's no longer showing on the site but um, taking a look at your competition here so like if we did a search it looks like the first thing in the map pack is Roman's beauty bar I did pull them up here as well looks like they don't have any referring domains or backlinks but they do have five keywords that are driving 21 people monthly to their site so in order to beat out your competition you want to make sure that you're being found in a lot of the same places that they're being found and just like citations you do not want to stop there in order to really truly beat out your competition you want to make sure that you're adding more um, so that's really pretty much it. I hope this video has been educational for you. If you would like to know more about Duff Digital Marketing and how we can help grow your business via your online presence, uh, please give me a call and we can chat. And like I said before, if not, no worries at all. Enjoy the free tips that I've given you. And if you could just give me some feedback on this video and let me know how I did, that would be much appreciated. Thank you, Brandy. I hope you have a great rest of your day.